boys and girls. This is gonna be our day two science lesson. So I have my All About Me science page with my four boxes all ready to go. If you still need to get yours, go ahead and pause this video and go ahead and grab your materials so that we can get ready. Okay, if you're all set, then we're gonna get started. Yesterday, we, yesterday I talked to you about how this time is gonna be, sometimes it's gonna be science, sometimes it's gonna be social studies, sometimes it'll be a mix of both or it'll be social emotional learning where we talk about um, some skills like how to make friends or rules in school, being nice to each other, stuff like that. Um, and so we had started this all about me activity with some science and social studies concepts. So we took our paper and we broke it up into four boxes and in the first box, you wrote your favorite type of weather. And so you can see Miss P loves winter. I love snow. So that's my favorite. Winter is my favorite season and snowy is my favorite type of weather. Your box probably looks different though. If you do not like snow, maybe you like sunny or windy or rainy or a different type of weather. So your box might look a little bit different. We're gonna go over now to box two. And in box two, we are going to draw something that will tell us a little bit about you. And in this second box, what we are going to draw is our favorite animal. So I want you to think of your favorite animal. What's your favorite type of animal? I told you during our morning meeting yesterday what my favorite type of animal was. I told you that my favorite animal is a giraffe. So I like giraffes. Maybe you have a different favorite animal. So I want you to go ahead and think about what your favorite animal is. And when you know, you're going to go ahead and draw your favorite animal in the box. So I'm going to draw a giraffe in the box. I'm gonna use my pencil to start just in case I need to erase anything. And remember, we're just trying our very best. It doesn't have to be perfect, okay? Because Miss P is not an artist, but she's gonna do her very best to try and draw a giraffe. So I'm gonna draw the giraffe's nose area and then the rest of his head and some ears. And then a long neck coming down from his head because we know giraffes have long necks and that's gonna move into his body I'm gonna make kind of like a circle shape for his body and giraffes have four legs coming out of their body two three four and I cannot forget the tail on my giraffe right we don't want to forget that I'm also missing some eyes and some nostrils, right? I could even draw a little smile there, his tongue sticking out. Giraffes have very long tongues that they use to eat the leaves and the trees. I also am going to want to add some giraffe spots. So I'm making some shapes to kind of make it look like a giraffe. Do you see that there? I think I did a pretty good job, right? I tried my best and I think it, it turned out good. I took it slow. I used shapes that I know. I used circles and dots and, and lines. So I think I did pretty good. You can go ahead and color your picture if you're going to use a pencil. I would want to go ahead and trace over my picture with some crayons or markers or colored pencils and color it so that um, you can see a picture a little bit better and it's colorful. I'm going to write some words that you might want to write though in this box too. I'm going to write, I like, I like, I and then like is L-I-K-E. I like giraffes. Do you see that? So I want you to give this a try and try to write the words I like in your box and draw your picture 
of your giraffe, okay? Well, not your giraffe. I'm sorry. You're going to draw your favorite animal. Maybe your favorite animal is a giraffe, but maybe it isn't. I'm excited to see what your favorite animal is, okay? I hope you have a lot of fun with this box. Thanks, friends.